is a blow Shoots up through the stony ground There's no room Hi, I'm Dr. Daniel Friedland, the founder and CEO of Super Smart Health, a company dedicated to empowering your health and well-being. I am very excited to be able to share with you an iPhone application we've just launched called Timeless Reminders. What Timeless Reminders enables you to do is to collect your most inspiring photos, videos, music, audio and text to create rich multimedia movies that you can schedule to be sent to yourself to remind you about what's important in your life and to motivate you to take action to achieve the health, well-being and success you desire. Timeless Reminders is really versatile. Among its many uses, you can create and schedule reminders to more fully appreciate your relationships and bring a little bit more love into your life. Celebrate a special events like anniversaries and birthdays, eat well and exercise, take your medications on time, connect with your creative vision, focus and take action to reach your goals, take time, breathe and de-stress, uh, laugh and have fun, connect with your source of inspiration, act in line with your core values, and much more. Let me show you how this works. After you download Timeless Reminders from the iPhone App Store, you'll see this icon here that symbolizes wholeness which interestingly is the root of the word health. So in large part, Timeless Reminders is designed to remind you of the wholeness that you are, to provide you with a foundational sense of health and well-being, especially since it's really easy to forget and lose our sense of wholeness in the middle of all our daily stress. Tapping on this icon, we arrive at the Timeless Reminders home screen over here. Actually, the first time you do this, you'll arrive at the email opt-in stream. Please sign up to join us in the Timeless Reminders community where we'll be sharing inspiring quotes, photos, tips and updates to help you use Timeless Reminders to its full extent. On the home screen, you'll notice that Timeless Reminders is divided into four sections, resources, reminders, tags and settings. We'll start here with resources, which is a multimedia library into which you can import from your iPhone's camera roll, photos and videos, or from the iPod music. You can also capture on the run um, photos and videos, as well as audio and text. This is really simple to do. Let's say I want to help myself de-stress a bit more. I'll tap here to import some photos from my camera roll. Now, when I get stressed out, the place that I like to go, uh, where I live here in San Diego, is Torrey Pines. Uh, it's a fantastic place to just unwind. So I'll select these photos here to put them in my resource library. I'll choose these four over here. I'll choose uh, another four ending the day with a beautiful sunset on Torrey Pines. Done. Now these pictures are in the photo file in the library, which you can see here. We can similarly do the same thing for videos and music, which unfortunately the simulator does not enable me to demo for you right now. To capture various resources, we simply tap on any of these buttons over here. Let me show you how to capture a little piece of audio. To do that, all you do is just tap on the audio section over here, and here you get a record button. Recording is really easy to do. To record, all you do is tap this button here to start, and then when you're done, tap it again to stop. So I'm gonna make a very short recording that I'll use in my um, uh, stress reduction reminder a little bit later on. Breathe. Okay, so that's uh, gonna be just a short bit of audio that'll remind me to breathe. So I'll title this at the top over here, Breathe. I could also um, designate this as a favorite if I wanted to. Now I could also provide a tag for this item, which I like to think of as the various parts contributing to my sense of wholeness. For example, mind, body, spirit, family, love, work, friends, nature, and so on. I'll tag this as spirit and show you a little bit later where this shows up in the, uh, in the tag section. So we go back to audio, uh, resources, and here it is in the resources. You can also provide titles, favorite designations, and tags for all of your other resources as well as your reminders. So for example, if you go to photos, I can pick any one of these photos. I'll take this one up here, for example, 
and uh, just type in here to title the photo, let's say Tory Pines. I could designate that as a favorite if I wanted to. And again, I could provide a tag over here. And this time, let's say we'll tag this with uh, the tag nature. And that goes in. And again, I'll show you where that shows up a little bit later on. Let me also show you how to capture a little bit of text. This is really easy too. To capture text, click on that. And here into the body, I'll put in the text to go along with the audio I just made, breathe. I resources. Now this section is great for cutting and pasting from the web, inspiring quotes and poems that you can overlay to make very rich reminders too. So here we go back and we've assembled all our resources. Now here's where the fun really begins.